Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Mike Graves, your host for What's New at Sophos. And today we're going to take a look at a new early access program for Sophos Mobile. The early access program is called Sophos User Activity Verification. So what is this? What it is is it provides a way to get additional context from admins or users through their mobile devices. How it works is through the Intercept X for mobile app on either Android or iOS, and it establishes a secure and rapid channel of communication between that device and Sophos Central. What can we do with this? So today we can do things like request information from a user about potentially suspicious activity detected on their machine, or we can ask an admin for approval for a specific action before we actually allow that action to happen. So how do we use this? It's available through the Sofo Central API, uh, and that means it can be integrated with external tools and workflows, such as SOAR tools. And we'll be looking at one of Sophos's SOAR tools in the demo portion. All right, so let's take a look at how this works. The User Verification API lets you send questions or what we call attestations to a user's mobile device. The user can then respond to that question by clicking one of the provided answers. User will need an Android or iOS device with Sophos Intercept X for mobile app installed, and it must be managed by Sophos Central. If the user has more than one mobile device, the attestations are sent to each device associated with that user. And once they've responded to those questions, their answers are then sent back to Sophos Central and retrievable using the Suave API. So this is in early stages right now, but we have plans to build this into the XDR investigations later this year, which would allow uh, an admin to message a user to get more context around a particular detection. We might also be looking to integrate this with third party tools to approve actions. For example, when a new admin user has created an active directory, we can send a swab message to another admin asking for confirmation. Looking down the road, we may even be able to observe a detection or action, prompt the user for context, and then use the central APIs to do something like isolate a device or initiate a scan. These are just some of the possible ways we can use this technology. It will be really interesting to see how it progresses. And if you have any thoughts or suggestions of useful ways that this could be used, please make sure to send them through to us. We'll ultimately be adding some uh, logging or auditing of the questions and responses that will be able to be viewed through Sophos Central Admin, but no timeline on that just yet. All right, let's have a quick look at this in action here. Okay, so earlier I mentioned that Sophos has a SOAR tool. Um, this comes to us through an acquisition last August of a company called Refactor. And Refactor um, built a product that's basically a DevSecOps automation platform, allows you to run various pipelines using the tools and utilities that you see on the left-hand side. It's quite powerful. So Sophos will be introducing this as a solution, I believe later this year, and it's what we're gonna use for today's demo. So you can see on the very top of the pipeline, we have an API call to the Sofo Central APIs to get our Sofo Central token. And then over here, we have all of the information we need to ask the user a question. In this case, we're asking them, hey, we found a threat detected on this Win 10 Pro 01 machine. Are you at your computer right now? Uh, option one we can see is yes, option two is no, and option three is not at the computer, or not my computer, sorry. Um, so we'll submit that to the user. They will get that as a pop-up in their Intercept X for mobile application. They'll select whatever response they like, and that'll be returned through the Swab APIs to us here on the console. So let's go ahead and kick this off. Now we've built some pauses in here to allow for uh, the time it would take for a user to get and respond to a message. 
You can see here our iPhone has received a message from the Intercept X for mobile application saying threat detected on machine Win 10 Pro 01. Are you at your computer? So if I simply click that notification, I'm brought straight into the application, shown that question, and I can choose from my different options for response. I'm going to choose not at my computer. So you can see we're in a holding pattern now waiting for that user to respond. In a moment, um, we'll be gathering that response using the Suave APIs. Okay, looks like our pipeline is complete. So if we come in here and we look at the raw text, go all the way down to the bottom, we'll be able to see the Suave response from that user was option three. And just to review, option three was not my computer. All right, so how do we get started with this? So first, you're gonna log into Sophos Central, click your name in the upper right, and click Early Access Programs. In there, you'll see a new Early Access Program called User Activity Verification. You're gonna to wanna to join that. Once you're done joining the EAP, then you go, go ahead to Global Settings and find User Activity Verification, and then simply just enable the slider. So that's all for now. Uh, I will put links to information and guidance for Suave in the video description below. Uh, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.